it's your boy BDB. We are on the road heading to my new booth that I set up in a peddler's moth slash flea market. Uh, I've added some stuff there to it, but I have not filmed at it yet. Uh, I talked to the owner. They said they are all about me filming in there because if I film there, it's going to bring service to customers. So it brings customers into his booths and into his flea market slash peddler's mall. This is just a little county flea market slash peddler's mall, but I've been wanting to set one up. What I did is got a lock glass lock box. Uh, I'm real particular about stuff being in behind stuff because there's been many times I go to a Goodwill or even a Peddler's Mall and look inside the case, there's no game. I do not want that to happen to my items. That's why it's behind a lock box. So, got it all locked up. There's going to be a little bit of everything in my booth from glassware, from corningware to uh, Pyrex glass, even. Um, trying to do antiques a little bit which that's pretty new to me and I'm doing video games and consoles in my booth too as well I am doing toys as uh, the little figures of spider-man and Iron Man and stuff like that but I ain't put them in there just yet so my goal is to fill this up as quick as possible so I can start making cash in my booth uh, you'll see what I got in there when we get in there. We'll take a tour of the place, show you around. If you're local and you're, you like what you see on there uh, and you're interested in something, go check out the booth. I'll drop the link and where the location and everything is at the Peddler's Mall and the uh, flea market. So follow me, Big DB. Follow me, Big Daddy Brian Thrifts and oh by the way go like and subscribe to my channel I'm gonna have some new lives going on soon probably maybe even do a live from the peddler's mall that i'm in so check it out set it tight you won't want to miss this folks bdb out I'll press all right folks we just got to the flea market area that we're setting up the boo boo fat this is what it looks like uh, I'm gonna drop a link of the address. It's called Martin's Flea Market. Uh, very good, nice spot. Super nice people working here. Uh, I would come check out what they go. Come on, let's uh, scroll through and see what they got. And percolators and an electric percolator. This is a kind of a rare one. It's spice of life. It's got the cord and everything with it. And this floor up here is getting into the video game stuff. I got Amazing Spider-Man, Resident Evil 2, double disc, a PS2 bundle, Harry Potter, a loose disc of Avatar the game. I got an NES clone, a Hyperkin Samsung design that makes your phone into a Game Boy some blank cassettes because everybody likes them these days it seems like and this is what i worked on today for about two or three hours putting these wii games and listing them with the booth number and how much they cost and the, the uh what they are been working on that got a nice little wii bundle and a huge draw in here so i put a few things in here last week but i got a lot more in here this week uh take you a tour of the place uh and i'll drop a line of the address if you're interested come in and see what all the great vendors have here at the peddler's mall Ooh, that's nice that'd be fun for the summer some cornhole looks like a cornhole set for 15 dollars for the bags not bad nice boards Wars and games. So if you live close to Lawrenceburg, I would definitely check this place out. Got some Hot Wheels leading the way. 
some planes, some cars. People love cars. Let's see. We got some Thomas the Train, some Peanuts and Friends. We might find something for us. In the, ooh, look at that. Super Mario Donkey Kong van. That's pretty sweet. Something you don't see every day. That old phone is cool. Let's see what else we can find. I love this stuff right here. It's beautiful. Old radios and clocks. Nice. Let's see. Let's see if we can find some video games for our collection. Or something to add. There's Mr. Old Santa Claus. Some comic books. These look like newer ones, but they're still really cool. $3. That ain't bad. Not bad at all. Ooh, we got some video games. So we got some competition. We got Sonic the Hedgehog. NBA Live. UFC. Twenty nineteen. I also got Mortal Kombat for five. That's not bad. <clears throat> Enter the Matrix. That looks like a fun game. We got some DS. Got a nice little Wii game system here too. Got some military colors. Look at all them derby glasses. Them are pretty. Nice. Knives and lighters. Case knives. They're pretty. Beautiful. Let's see what we got. We got a bunch of DVDs, it looks like. Shopkins Collect Them 10. That's pretty cool. Shopkins do really good for me at a flea market. I've sold a bunch of them at a flea market. Uh, I set up in the summer and the spring. Uh, pay fifteen dollars. I usually make two or three hundred dollars doing that Just for one day on the weekend pretty easy pretty fun I usually pull my camper down to where the flea market sets up. I'll show you some videos of that later on this year make some Got some tools everybody needs some tools Let's see Ooh, we got a PlayStation they're wanting $14.50 for it. Not too bad. The original PlayStation. I still got my original, uh, but I painted on it. The, it is what it is. You know, you kid, you do stuff. <laughs> got some old books. Nice. Ooh, we got some plush. Some plushy plush. That's cool. Some electronics. Look at this, folks. It's an old iMac computer. That's sweet. $100. That's not bad for something you can't find anymore. If you're interested now to come to this Lawrenceburg, Kentucky, drop the uh, link in there for you of the address. That's really sweet. I had We had one of them in high school. My junior and senior year thought it was really cool do you find anything this is a nice mirror if you need a mirror too you can find it here <laughs> it didn't have the collar though ooh some video games now we talking we got crank yankers we got NES controller, $10. That's not bad. Folks, if y'all need an NES controller to complete something, this would be the spot to get it. Call of Duty Ghost. This was such a fun game growing up. Me and my neighborhood buddies would play that. We did the drag racing one. That was so fun. You remember that, Jared, Marcus, and Taylor? <laughs> 
what we got here. Then 10. Wipe out two. Ooh, here's a little info. This game right here, it's about a $15 game. The 10, 15 to 15, 10. But if it was the 2K18, it'd be about a 20 or $30 game. Cause that's the last one made for the Xbox 360 and PS3. Not too bad. Ah. It's Mickey Mouse. That's cool. Uh -huh. Really? Uh -huh. Yeah, I thought that I've never seen someone vlog like out in public before. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what in the world is he doing? <laughs> I do a YouTube channel. What's it called? Big Daddy Brian Thrifts. I've saw that before. I'm not actually scrolling yet. Oh, okay. So you... I have to look at what's it called again? Big Daddy Brian Thrifts. Okay. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. It's nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. You take care. She's seen my name scrolling on there. Ooh, look at here. See, folks, I got one of these in my booth. That's about the same price. That's pretty, too. I love that, like, yellow acorn squash looking color. It's pretty. I love me some pyrus dishes corner where it does really really well Ooh, we got a bunch of cookers 39 dollars that's not bad these folks these things right here are amazing i got one at the house worth every bit of eighty dollars i'm telling you if you're local and you need one of these come here and get one this is a good deal this thing i put everything in that i love it Ooh, look at that 1998 University Champions NCAA. Sweet. Wheel of Fortune board game. Look at this. It's been a solid long minute since I've seen that. It is Joe Campbell money. That's nuts. We'll come back. Ooh, a Mad Cats. Genesis controller. Ooh, it's got the turbo modes on it. This is some old school Mad Cats right here. I have never seen that symbol. I'm used to seeing the ones. Oh, this is 93. See, I used a lot of Mad Cat stuff for my PlayStation 2 because the Mad Cats was very good, very good. That and Pelican for secondhand controllers and steering wheels and stuff like that. But I've never seen a Mad Cats that old. That's pretty sweet. Let's see, we got some bundles right here. That's really cool. Look at this little teapot. That's pretty. Everything a dollar. So if you need something cheap, everything's a dollar in here. Like, this is a nice looking little umbrella. Um, it's a totes brand umbrella for a dollar. That's not bad pretty nice you never know what you're gonna find in the dollar aisle it's nuts what kind of cups we got here that ain't a bad deal for the, the, that either we got some beads we got some grape jelly got some glassware Ooh, look at these halo 5 guardian tans 395 has got t-shirt in there and some bookware 395 not bad that's cool right there